Hello to everyone, let's see how to create your authentication app in Django. Please don't forget to subscribe and like. Here I have the Django project and if you don't know how to create the Django project, please see the link in the description of this video. So uh, we first we will have a uh, app. So we have here our start app and the main. Okay, and uh, we have the folder here. So we have to or uh, uh, Django to know that uh, we had the app. We have to include it here. And then now uh, we can uh, have templates. So uh, we will need a login template. We will also need the logout and the portrait uh, template. So uh, we can include the folder. And also, um, we will have a many template that is base template. And so all the other templates will extend to this template. So let's have a base here. Here we have a base HTML file. So we here we use a bootstrap in this uh, for uh, login forms. And they uh, also have uh, some styles. And uh, here we will include the header we will have a block content so out of a, a, a html file will extend this a base a html file so and also we'll have footer so we have to add this a header first this a, is a place that a, a, we will display a, the message on the top of the a page and we have also the link for logout. So let's head a footer. Here we have the footer, and now we can head the uh, login. So here uh, we have a login uh, a file. Uh, we uh, extend it to BC. And here we have the title that will be displayed and the, the content that will be in uh, the uh, blog content. So it's uh, the action uh, will uh, direct to the, the login uh, view and the method is posted. So because we are using a uh, confidential information here, the password. And uh, 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 we have the submit. Uh, so he have here email uh, input for email and also uh, the uh, password let's have a logout so when a logout is performed we will uh, show this link that the log uh, uh, the logout was successful and uh, we will uh, also uh, play, uh, see the link to login again let's now have a protected so uh, this uh, message will come from a uh, uh, the and the uh, 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 we have here uh, the logout the and the uh, this page only uh, we can see if we log it in successful if not if this page would not uh, be displayed because it's a protected page so now we can head the views so here we have a login view if it's already uh, authenticated uh, we only use we display the message the user is uh, login and uh, we redirect it to the protected uh, page so uh if a uh, uh, it's not authenticated we uh, get a user and password and uh, we perform the authentication and if it, uh, the user is not or none we uh, uh, just we redirected the uh, 
protected page and also uh, we display message success successful logged in so i'll see uh we display the message in field the username and password and if uh, here uh if none of this uh, happen we uh uh, display the login uh, page so uh, we render a login HTML uh, file so here is required a uh, user to be authenticated to uh, display uh, the pages of this view so that's why we have this decorator and also we have a uh, option we had a uh, argument to redirect user to the login page and here we log out uh, the user so we can head the uh, urls here we uh, from admin we import uh, views and then now we can head so here we have a login page the view it's a login view uh, the name is login we have a protected and we have a logout so now uh we uh, save the uh, project and we have to run migration so uh, we have here a uh, python uh manage make migration is the first step and we'll run and now we migrate my grid okay now we have the tables in the database so now we can uh, create the uh, super user so uh admin 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 uh, example admin one two three again admin one two three and the uh, uh, bypass it, the password the validation yes okay and now we can uh, test the uh, our app. So let me uh, run server. I can open. So uh, we here we need to. Uh, we can test now. Uh, protect protected and he redirect us uh, to login page so we can uh, test with wrong uh, password so uh, we uh, please invalid username and password so now let me have valid user and also valid a uh, password so uh, now I can uh, see uh, welcome you are in a protected page so let me test here to pocket it and uh, now let me log out and uh, try to refresh this page redirect me to a login page so uh, i can again uh, type admin one two three and now i am the protected page again so let me try to uh, go to the uh, login page so uh when i click i come to the they redirect me uh, the application redirect me to protect the page because i already uh, authenticated thank you for watching please don't forget to subscribe and like